Hello, 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 and welcome to A Little to Luck. Today we are doing the new Taily Tidings levels where we're organizing what it looks to be bats. So let's just hop right into it. So I'm assuming that somehow these are gonna like go into the different like wing shapes like this. I don't think that one quite fits, but we're looking for similar curves that would like fit over multiple bats, I think is our goal here. So we're just gonna keep moving these around until something feels right and it looks like some of these will go like underneath i don't think that one goes there it could go there but i'm not, I'm not sold on that one i think this one goes here maybe and then i'm not sure if that one this one could go here actually quite nicely i think i wonder if there's going to be multiple solutions to this one i think it's possible Oh, okay, so it did do like the sticky thing when it was correct. So maybe that one goes there, that one goes there. I always like that about this game is that it gives you that little like sound indicator. But hey, you did something right. Very good. I think this one's gonna have to like go down here somewhere. I'm not quite sure where. Same with this one. I'm not quite sure where that's gonna go. That one's gonna go over there. That one's right there. I think that one goes there and then this one here and this one's the last one that we got to figure out not quite sure where he's gonna go none of this feels quite right and i don't think we can just like throw him on the edge i don't think that's gonna be this oh right here very cute very cute so it looks like there's only one solution for that one but i like that one okay what do we have here it looks like we have some pumpkins it looks like there might be there could be a few solutions, but I think we go maybe tallest to shortest. Is there multiple? Okay, there's four. So let's figure out the other ones of those. Let's go back. So we have the height. I think we have like the amount of twist in the stem. No, don't don't go again. Okay, so we have one twist, two twist, three twist. Does this one have the most? That one looks like it has the most. One, two, three, four. Is that the same solution? That feels like the same solution. Yeah. We could maybe go by expression. But those all feel, I mean, this one is like so happy. This one feels happier. So happiest, so angriest to happiest, basically. Then we have two more to go. Hmm. We could try and do like the roundness of the eyes, but that feels, that doesn't feel right. And they're all kind of lumpy. Like that feels like the most gradual I think to me, but I don't think that's it. Oh, we have the, um, if we look up here, so we have one, two, three, four, five. So the little edges at the top of the pumpkin where they're cut. What else do we have? We have one more. Hmm. We could go by teeth. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five. That should be the last one. No. Did we do that one? I didn't think we did that one already. I suppose the expressions match the amount of teeth. So then what else do we have? That's the teeth one again. Mm. Okay, I have one, one other idea. What if we were to do like, kind of like an arch? And we switch those two? Like, have them all kind of pointing towards? I think that was it, yep. That one was turkey though. For sure, for sure. Well, the bucket levels though took a moment we have so much candy okay is this going to be one of the symmetry ones i think never been my strong suit doesn't mean we won't try though oh there's so much here so we do have two lollipops i thought that one snapped nicely and then it didn't we have two of these I'm gonna like put them into piles of stuff to start with because I'm not really sure what else to do to be honest. I don't know if that's the solution, but it's it's what we're trying today. So we'll put all of our candy canes in a spot. Not candy canes, candy corn. Candy canes are far superior than candy corn. I'm not a big fan of candy corn, honestly. This probably isn't it, but it feels good to do. Right, can't grab that one. Put these two here. Oh, 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 there's two, okay. So we have one more solution on this one. 
So how else could we organize this? We could or because I organized them all into groups already. What else could we do? We could organize them by colors, right? Like put all the reds together, all the blacks together. There's some that kind of like mix and match colors though, right? So if we put like, I'm afraid that's just going to give us the same sort of thing though, won't it? I feel like this definitely isn't the solution, but we gotta try something, right? So we'll put these together, maybe put the black together, we'll put the oranges together. I'm not sure exactly how to handle the ones with multicolor things though, you know? And a lot of them will like self-group. So let's move all of these over to here. And then let's do yellow. This one has yellow. I'm doing it by like dominant color, I think. My solution here. There's no green, so we'll put the reds up here. Maybe we'll put... I want to move all those candy corn, so I'm just going to put these here. I don't think that's... I don't think that's it, unfortunately. Like it... I would almost have to do it in like a color way. So like this would be... That has like the gray, right? But see, I don't know if this makes any sense. So I feel like it really doesn't. I understand my logic here, but I don't think the game likes it. So what can we do different? Cat demands pets. Um, what else could we do here? What else could we do if not that? Because we can't organize them by the amount of waves they have because only a few items have that, right? And that would be self-grouping. Then um, we could try and organize it like the amount of colors. But again, that feels like you're just going to be grouping things by what they are then, right? I mean, it's worth a shot, I guess. Put the candy bars like here. Keep putting all our candy corn here. It's just going to self-group. I'm pretty sure. Unless we end up like putting multiple things together. Like these need to be with these. So I'm thinking like single color items. And then multiple colored items. Single colored items. This probably isn't it. But, but it, it's worth a it's worth a shot, right? I didn't like it. We could organize, actually, I think I might have an idea. We could organize by like the amount of stuff in each category. But again, that, that feels like we're just gonna end up with our own stacks again, right? Kind of like that. I'm actually kind of surprised it didn't let that happen because those are separate. I'm actually kind of surprised that didn't work that way. I'm curious if these can fit into each other in any way, shape, or form. That doesn't go there. These don't really fit together that nice. I do like the noises they make though. Those look like they go together kind of, but I'm not really sure what my plan is here, friends. Maybe, maybe, okay, I have an idea. It's kind of a wild idea, but maybe we make sure like each pile has like the same amount of stuff. That seems kind of far-fetched, but it's what I've got. So one, 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 one. So just one of every other. Feels like I could do that, maybe. I'm afraid of messing this up now and not being sure where I mess up. There it is. That one was so tough. Holy cow. We have bones. I'm curious how many solutions will be on this one, but let's just see if there's ways to maybe put these together. That feels like it as good of spot to start as any. Looks like those could go together. See what I mean? So I can't move this middle one. So maybe we build off of that one to start. So maybe there's like a shape that goes into it like that. Then let's look into here, see if there's any spot that can go there. It looks like I don't know what we're building. And we'll be connecting them off of these as well. It looks like I couldn't really see where my mouse was in that situation. I think that's going to go onto that one. 
We have like this curvy bit. We have a spiky bit. Spiky bit's gonna have to go. I'm not sure actually. I thought I knew. I don't know. That's gonna go there though for sure, for sure. So we're looking for a spot that could have that, which is not that one. This one could go there though. Maybe we're building like a, a hand or like a T-Rex paw maybe. Like T-Rex paw feels pretty plausible here. Wondering, okay, so those are gonna go here and here. So it's like a hand of some sort. That's gonna go there. That's gonna go somewhere else that's not there. I think that could go there. Then maybe little thingy goes there. That doesn't go there, but maybe there. Yep. I think this one could go here. So that means that one goes here. That goes there. That goes there. And then we have a spooky hand. I love the illustration on that. Very, very pretty. Can I not access that one yet? That one must be locked somehow. For some reason, I'm not sure quite why, but that's okay. All in all though, very cute puzzles, very cute. Always love this game, it's always a blast to play. If you haven't checked it out, the full game is fantastic. All the daily tidings are usually super fun. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and ciao friends. Thank you.